And still talking security, the Minister of Defence, Bashir Magashi, has expressed concern over the stiff challenges being faced by the federal government in stemming the lingering challenges of insecurity in the country. He expressed these views at a sent forth ceremony for about 93 generals who retired between 2019 and 2020. Defence correspondent Sifone Sien reports. <laughs> A dinner in honor of generals across the services who retired between 2019 and 2020. At least 93 of them are present at the event, which is the first of its kind. It is gratifying that this event marks the former and well-deserved farewell to our colleagues after a lifetime of service to our fatherland. Now please keep up this tradition because it is revolving and you may not know the effect and the morale of people who are here. It is something that you should keep up. It also gives me, in person, the confidence that you guys will work together and ensure that the security of this nation uh, is taken care of. The retired soldiers will now join the bulk of reserves who have often been neglected. For the Minister of Defence, that the security challenges in the country still lingers despite efforts of the federal government is a source of concern. Very soon, you will get us out of this uh, situation we found ourselves. I know some of you may not be happy that uh, the security situation in this country is still persistent. You wish you are still around to see the end of it all. But I assure you our juniors will continue to do justice to what we are doing. We will not fail you even when you are out of service. The security is everybody's business. Uh, but uh, unfortunately, it's like um, it has been left to the military. Uh, everybody has to be up and doing because um, it's the life of our people that uh, is at stake here. At the end of the day, the emphasis is on the need for a lot more inclusive effort in making the country safer. Sifon is CNTVC News, Abuja.